everyone, it's me JP from Unique Tutorials. Today, in this video, I will show you how to split a single large size file into multiple small size files for free in Windows, Mac, and Linux computer. So, without any further more delay, let's begin. So, right now, I'm using a Windows 11 operating system on my Raspberry computer. So, if you're using a Mac or Linux operating system on your Raspberry computer, still the tricks will remain the same. So firstly, let me show you, say I have one file here on my desktop. So let me show its properties. So here I have a file size of 127 MB. So if you have a GB size files also, still the tricks will remain the same. So how you can split this large size file into multiple small size files completely for free. So for this, what you need to do is just open any web browser and in the google search the search for one application name as 7 jeep and on the first list you will see its official website just click on it now you can see tons of download options so it already detected my Raspberry operating system so if you don't find your Raspberry operating system then you can just click on this download and now you will see here a download option for mac os and the above is for windows and there is also for linux portion so right now i'm using a windows operating system on my Raspberry computer so i'm gonna download a windows version so finally the file has been downloaded so let me go to the folder where it's being downloaded and let me close this web browser so just double click it to run this software installer click on install so finally the application has been installed successfully now click on close and just click on this windows start menu icon and click on this all apps and on the first list you will see here 7g folder just click on it and now you will see here the application 7g file manager that means this application is installed successfully so just click on it now you will see the user interface of this software right and now just drag the file here and on the first list you can see our ship so here you can change the file name also if you wish so i'll just keep it as it is and the second option you can see your our ship permit so which RC format you want to select so right now it's being selected in 7 chip you can choose the chip format also you can select our format different formats also so i'll just keep it as 7 chip and there is compression level different compression level you can compress it more to save more space or reduce it more smaller in size so depending upon your needs you can select your options so here you can see one option split to volume bytes right just click on here and now you will see here 10m that means it will split into 10 mb file size that means say if the file size is the 100 mb then it will split into 10 different file size having a 10 mb and if you're having a larger file size like the 1 gb or above than that then you can select more also depending upon how much MB or GB or KB you want to split. So right now just to give you an example, you can type also the numbers, but I will just select the available options here. You can type the respective numbers also if you wish. So I'll just click on 10 MB. Now even you can add a password if you want to set a password on this files, but right now I'll just keep it as it is. And once you're done with your settings, just click on OK. Wait for a few seconds. So now you can see on my desktop screen uh, multiple files right so you can see here that this one is the first file as you can see here and this one is the second file third file fourth file fifth file and so and so so the first file is a uh, 10 mb and the second file is also a 10 mb so it will split each small size files into almost 10 mb and the remaining last one is the 7.84 mb since the total file size was let me show you the total file size it was like 127 so it is split that way so now if you want to extract this file again you need to keep all these files in a single folder or a single locations if you keep each one file on the different folders or on the other folders then this file cannot be extracted so all these files should be on the same folder in order to extract this file again so firstly let me just delete this original file and now let us try to extract so to extract just right mouse click click on show more option now you'll see here 7 zip now extract here so you can see here we have finally extracted the large size file again 
now let me delete it again now you might be thinking if we delete the rest files then can we extract the single file so let us check if we can extract or not so let me right mouse click on it let me click on this some more options let me select 7 zip and let us try extract here so you can see here unexpected end of data that means fail to extract the file so that means we'll be needing all the small size files along with the first file in order to extract the original large size files so by using these cool tricks you can split a single large size file into multiple small size files for free in windows mac and linux computer very easily so if you've never known about the school tricks then you should definitely give it a try so if you find this video tutorial useful please click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching